hi guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back once again so today is on wednesday and i really really quickly wanted to i really wanted to give you um a quick update on um the performance of these perfumes uh on my last video i think i showed you guys what i got so we can start with this one i'm in love with this one i really really like it uh it's slightly it's it lasts a slightly longer than uh these three this one can give you like five let's say five hours five hours and then it fades off but you can still um smell it on your clothes just kidogo too but it's very strong when you of course apply it at first but this one lasts longer um this one i'm not the biggest fan of this i've only used it once since i bought it i feel like it's a sweet scent but it has some um, it's really mint some mintish um sort of like notes or something i've not uh checked what exactly what notes uh this perfume has but this is something that will probably need to grow on me before i like get used to it but i definitely definitely love this one um i've also used this i love it but it lasts slightly um a shorter time than this one this one lasts let's give it like maybe four hours and then you still have a whiff of it um throughout the day but four hours same as this this is actually what i have today yeah, I can still like smell it, but Nikombali, but it's really really nice when you smell it of course the first time. So something like this you can just put it in a travel size um perfume bottle and keep it in your bag. Please come. Hi. Hi. Mini Baridi. Mini Baridi. Baridi. I think she's coming. Hi. Thank you. Welcome. Yeah, Ella is here. So, no, 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 don't do that. Huh? Yeah. So, um, Mommy. my best is Mommy. this, followed by this Mommy. and this. Mommy. Yes. And lastly, we have this. So, um, what I can say about this? Is... <laughs> no, 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 no. Yes. One. Yes. Two. Three. <laughs> so no 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 mama don't pull it anyway so what i can say about these perfumes is that they are budget friendly and for a budget friendly perfume of course you wouldn't expect a lot from it so for the longevity plus the price i think it's okay um if you want something that lasts a little bit longer maybe you can take something that has wood i think anything that has wood is extremely strong so for me i don't <clears throat> for me i don't think i can stomach um wood every day it takes a bit of time for it to grow on you so i'd rather just go with a sweet scent um yeah so basically that is my opinion but this this is a nice scent this one i would definitely recommend um anyone to buy it it's beautiful and it lasts slightly longer than the three so i also got some two things from town i can clearly see ella is already unpacking but let me take one one that she hasn't mama don't do that she hasn't removed so i got myself a couple of chains this is how they came packaged i got them from a page yeah. on instagram called bloom bloom i think bloom collections or something like that they... <laughs> yeah so like i was saying let me just do this real quick i got myself some chains from um this page is called bloom collections i think on instagram they have a, sh uh, a shop in town i really really love the quality i got these are three and the pendants the pendants are really cute i'll take a picture of this slightly later on um i also got this this is how it came like this but ella minari ame tuanisha na ame you know ame yeah she's just uh moved it a little bit 
but they're really pretty so this one i just got them from a random guy i was just walking coming from this shop um i bumped into this other shop that had really nice chains so i picked these two from uh from him to the guy so from him and what else i also got this this and this this one okay my this is like the only way i can show you guys <laughs> so yeah i also got these two rings from bloom um also got this this these are two bracelets this one is i don't know slightly stronger and then there's this wobbly one and i also got actually just bought a bunch of things from um them I also got myself a pair of earrings this I like the way it's black and then colorless here because I think I have a similar chain somewhere yeah I actually have one extra chain but I have no idea where it has gone to um I also got scans for Ella these are small hoops for her and um I like the way they sort of package their studs yeah, so this is how they look like i hope my camera can focus or is focusing um they're really tiny and very cute i'll just take a picture again later so i think i have one more chain somewhere that i don't know where ella has put it because you yeah yeah she has definitely uh, oh no she hasn't it was actually the same it's because it was colorless so this one is sort of double-sided the one side is black and this other side is colorless so it matches really really well with these earrings so yeah this is what i got i really really wanted to like show you guys before i open them because again i don't want to be patient this time um i also got these are beauty cups I got them from Beauty Square KE. They really come in handy when you're washing your face on the sink because sometimes that water tends to run down your hands, which is very annoying. That feeling is ugh. so. These ones really help. I looked. I've been actually been looking for them um, for a while. I actually even considered shipping them, but thank God I bumped into this shop and they have they have this and um buns headbands they come as a set but you also have a choice of uh, buying separately so since i already have the headband i just bought this what else yeah the other one is a body shaper really nice i think i'll take a picture of it when i have it on so that you can get like a gist of how it looks like instead of just showing it to you yeah so that's it i really really wanted to do that very quickly because ella is a bit fussy she did not have she did not um take her afternoon nap today so she's a bit fussy i just want to go quickly feed her and then we think of sleeping before we do anything else so i'll see you guys tomorrow i hope yeah i've actually not said happy new year i hope you guys are having a fantastic start of your year i wish you nothing but the very best hi guys so today's on thursday and i felt like having something sweet in the morning for breakfast so i bought um some donuts from bubbly they have a shop i think um on a green square that road so i'm gonna have that with tea and i think i also had a donut yesterday but a different one because this one is vanilla craze so the one i had was caramel something i'll insert a picture somewhere and it was really really delicious so if you feel like you have like a sweet tooth and you want something sweet they are the people to go to and i also wanted to show you guys my office snack drawer so let me just finish real quick and then i show you what is in my drawer i have a very sweet tooth 
and generally I just have a bunch of things to snack on anytime like I'm hungry or I don't have time for breakfast or lunch. So basically this is my office snack drawer. Um, I have some blue band there, some grounded ginger, tea masala, I have some ground tea bags over there. That one is lemon tea. These ones are what I basically snack on when I feel like I'm hungry and I don't have time to look for something to eat very fast. So they have nuts, um, sesame seeds and honey. These are cookies from Paul's Cookies. If you have had cookies from Paul's Cookies, you know these cookies are the OG. I think maybe the cookies that have come close to these ones are cookies from Carrefour, but man, I love them. So I also love this. <laughs> these are my candy snacks. They're called Acharis. They're sweet and chilly at the same time. That's actually why I love them. They're sweet and chili sort of butter uh i also have some granola over here usually when i again don't have time to look for breakfast quickly i usually have granola and some flakes though i don't have flakes here because i don't have a container to put them in so i have some oreos some chocolate over here and sneakers i also have some little sachets oh and i also have this cold brew yeah so basically this is how my snack drawer looks like though i feel like it needs like a proper sort of arrangement this is just nah. so i'm gonna arrange it um yeah soon so for some reason today i am craving um i don't know how to call it you need junk yeah carbohydrates or something like that so I ordered some things it's been a minute since i took bread so i've also ordered some bread and um what else tea scones i think and i'm not sure what i ordered you know this be a shadow of ordering things when you're hungry so this is what i did so i'm sure one of them is bread and the other ones i think are just some more carbs <laughs> So this is what I got. I got some cookies, some garlic bread, some tea scone and bread. I'm going to devour this in a bit because yo garlic bread slaps. I also got some grapes that I've already soaked in vinegar water, some tomatoes and some onions. Kafo has been having offers on onions and tomatoes so I've been buying from them for a while. So today I've decided to batch make my cereal so i already have some drink over there that have already been boiled these are pinto beans that i soaked overnight so i'm just waiting for whatever is on the jiggle to finish and then i can add this these are yellow beans though so this one i'm likely to mix them with maize so that i can cook githeri this one will just be plain beans i already have some githeri um, on the jiko and then i also need to boil some what is it called some jahe and i don't know i didn't i forgot to buy kamande so chances are i'm going to do that maybe sometime next week so my githeri is already ready for packing i usually pack them in those uh plastic bags and then stuff them in the freezer So this is currently how my freezer looks like. I usually just boil stuff and then portion them in, uh, put them away, I mean in small portions so that when you remove one, you just remove completely without returning any that needs to be refrozen again. Um, I also have some green that I boiled, but I didn't show you. Um, I think most of the things here are, is it not one Minji, Minji was my job, but this is meat. Um, have some ice cream there. These are my green shorts. And then I think these are frozen bananas. 
So um, I even cleaned my face. I wish, I really, really, really wish we did like a video, but there's always a next time. Yeah. So at least my freezer is. I can't even move this. Usually I can move this like this. But this one is not moving because there are a lot of things now Hi. So yeah. Hi. Hi. I still have some beans that are soaked that I'm going to soak overnight and then cook tomorrow. This one is going to be dairy because I've checked and I feel like I don't have enough Gideri because we cook Gideri I think once a week or something like that so I feel like I still need more so I'm going to boil this tomorrow and then I have some guashe here that I'm also going to boil tomorrow and some mitungo these ones are going to be for breakfast yeah so I'm sure by the time this video is up these ones um has it aqua tayari so yeah basically that is it so I'm gonna see you guys in my next one have a good week. Ciao. And it's finally time to remove the Christmas tree. So until December, guys, we still have like 11 more months left. <laughs> yeah.